Uh, things are just underway here on the steps of Queen's Park. You can see behind me uh, about 25 people have uh, kind of mobilized here just to take part in this multi-faith uh, debate on uh, free speech. Now, the controversy, uh, controversial anti-Islamic pastor from Florida, Terry Jones, as you mentioned, was a no-show. Now, he was scheduled to square off against a Toronto imam and a Muslim leader to talk about that film, Innocence of Muslims. You know, as we remember, this film uh, incited mass riots across the world. Now, Jones made headlines uh, also two years ago when he marked the ninth anniversary of 9-11 by burning copies of the Quran. Now, we found out this afternoon he was denied entry into Canada as border officials couldn't determine whether or not he had a criminal record in the U.S. So he is a no-show, as you mentioned. Now, meanwhile, we did speak to a Muslim leader uh, tonight who expressed his disappointment that Jones won't be here to take part in the debate. I, I am disappointed. Yeah, that the best antidote for hate speech is truth. And uh, I think, you know, hate speech needs to be confronted face to face. So I, I would have really enjoyed the opportunity to do that. Now, it's an interfaith rally. So, I mean, obviously, why is he uh, the headliner, so to speak? Well, the controversy, right? I mean, uh, it's gonna bring it's gonna bring people out and uh, allow. The controversy, them. you mean, when he uh, burned the Quran? Yeah, the Quran burning, right? That's the that's his, uh, I guess, his shtick. Um, but uh, mainly, I think, as you said, interfaith event. You'll see that a lot of people disassociate themselves, whether they're Jewish, Christian, or whatever, uh, from from the kind of stuff that he represents. So I think overall, it'll be a good thing. You obviously, you have strong opinions about the film. Oh, I think the film sucked big time. All right, so democracy at work tonight on the steps of uh, Queen's Park. Now, uh, another thing we do have here is a heavy police presence, uh, both uh, Toronto Police and OPP. Of course, they were anticipating uh, emotions to run high and uh, just a, a lot of... Uh, uh, a, a lot of people just talking on both sides, debating uh, the merits of this movie. So, again, uh, it's going to be pretty peaceful, we can tell, just from the small crowd that's here tonight. 